a lot of questions about how to clean your jewelry pandora does sell a jewelry cleaner i'm gonna show you guys how to use that today so when you buy the cleaning kit it comes with a little polishing cloth and like a little toothbrush but i have my own supply so i'm just gonna use that instead i use this one this is my favorite kind of polishing cloth from pandora so if you see that your like rings or charms or like earrings are turning a little different color um it just needs to be cleaned silver naturally um tarnishes so all you have to do is clean it when you polish it, you're going to see the little chemical reactions on the cloth itself. Once you're done polishing it, you want to put it inside the solution and leave it for about two to five minutes. Once I take it out of the solution, I put it in soapy water and then I brush it with a toothbrush. Pat dry and then it should be good to go. Hello and welcome back to Jewels Fail where we discuss some of the best and latest jewelry accessories you can find online both for men and women. Please subscribe to our channel if you love finding unique and fashionable jewelry pieces at affordable prices. Secrets from working at Pandora part 3. Here's the jewelry from before, still soaking. I will tell you guys how your jewelry gets tarnished and how to prevent it from being tarnished. Your rings and bracelets and necklaces tarnish when you don't wear them as often or if you leave them in a confined space. I find that actually leaving my jewelry sit out on my dresser in a jewelry dish, it doesn't get tarnished at all, versus keeping it closed in a box where oxygen gets to it, causing it to oxidize and turn black or green. You can clean all of your jewelry just like this, even jewelry with real diamonds. It's super safe for the metal and for the stones and really easy. Bracelet hacks. <laughs> So you want a Pandora bracelet, but you don't want to pay $90 for it. I get that. Leather. These bracelets are $45. Super great to start out with. They're really comfy and they are super casual. Princess ring, toothbrush. Remember how it was black in the beginning? Nope. Cleaning my Pandora rings at home because they get dirty. Usually I take them in to get cleaned. But here we go. Grab an old bowl, pour some hotish water in, not too hot. Very liquid. And drop them in. They need to soak for quite a long time, so be prepared. You need to get a little toothbrush as well to get in all the nooks and crannies, but first we're just gonna leave them to soak. My son's first toothbrush, just Look at that dirt, minging. All finished, nice and clean. Look at the dirt. Mm. Okay, so now I'm gonna teach you guys how to clean your Pandora product because I've gotten many comments about that and I'm gonna teach you how to keep your products clean and how we clean the stuff here at the store. Right off the bat, we fill up this bowl with hot water, this dish soap, then we add the soap. We're kind of running out, but then we add the soap. Then just mix and let it soak. Like you could start seeing a little dirt. That is one way we do it. The other way we, and then after that, obviously you dry it. And then with this polishing cloth that we sell here, you polish it. It's only $5. It leaves it like new. Like new. And after you clean it, it would end up looking like this. That's how you know they work. Yes, your bracelets are this dirty. Then, if you don't want to do all that, we sell our Pandora cleaning kit, which comes with a solution. Comes with our cleaning solution. So this is how we clean your Pandora jewelry. As you can see, it's very, very dirty. And it's not damaged or anything, it's just, it just needs some cleaning. So we stick it in our cleaner, that you put right here. Press the button, we'll wait till it's finished. So now we take it out of here, and it's still dirty as you can see. So we go right here, rinse off with some water, put a bunch of Don soap on it. Then, what we're going to do is start scrubbing. Now, after we scrub it, stick it again. Now we take it out, rinse it off, and we dry it. So make sure it's super dry, and this is what we use, a polishing cloth. We use it for other jewelry, but it's clean because it has a chemical on it. Now, all we do is start rubbing it to relieve the metal. 
And this is your jewelry now. You see how sparkly it is? Make sure you clean your jewelry often because if not, it's gonna get tarnished again.